Hi everybody, my name is Steve, aka Daddy Duke. This video is about building a paper towel holder with a shelf. A friend of mine has an auto repair shop that I was helping out and whenever it came time to change the empty roll of the paper towel, it was on a bungee cord that you had to unhook from a screw and you had to stand on your tippy toes to unhook it. And that got a little frustrating. So I thought I'd help him out and put something up for him. This is what I came up with. I have to give some credit to other YouTube sites because I searched around for a design of a paper towel holder uh, but it didn't quite fit what I wanted to do, so I took some ideas from them and uh, put mine together. I put together a list of materials, the diagram how to cut some of the pieces, and some short instructions. So I hope you enjoy it. So here we have our pieces that have been cut and the first step. We have our two sides, our top, our brace in the back, our roller for the tails, two end pieces, and four I've chosen number 10 inch and a half wood screws. I've already opened up the, the uh, doorknobs a little bit so that I can have the screws recessed. Here we have the two side pieces at different stages. Following the plans, I drilled a one inch hole with a spade bit and then using a jigsaw, a one inch radius, a one inch radius, a half inch radius, and I finished to cut through. Now I'll do the same with this piece. All our pieces have been cut now. They've been sanded, a nice bevel put all around the front leading edges. We did not sand the back because that's where our brace is going to go. Roller fits in nice. And our end caps were drilled and countersunk. So the screw head fits in nice. Now here's the first step in our assembly. I've uh, put the brace on the rear with uh, two finishing nails and one screw. That should be enough to hold it. It doesn't take a lot of weight. Now the top is laid on with glue and a few finishing nails. I'll countersink them and sand, give it a light sanding and we'll put some varnish on it or a clear coat. See, see what we have. Now I found our countersunk our finishing nail holes and filled them in with uh, wood filler. I'll sand that down. And then here's our uh, roller. Just have to apply the end pieces in and we're finished with the hardest part of our job. Here's the finished product from our work. 
He has a nice shelf on the top. Easily dispenses paper. And when the route, when the towel is empty, easy to change. Very strong construction. I think he'll be happy with it. I just wanted to give a little information about the finish that I used on the project. I used Varathane Stain and Poly. This is Summer Oak. Did a beautiful finish on it, I think. I hope you enjoyed the video and good luck with the project. So for now, goodbye from Daddy Duke.